But my heart becomes free Oh, thank you And my shame and guilt is undone It's because of your presence, Lord So we cry Holy Spirit, you are welcome here Come flood this place And fill the air Okay, so I'm getting ready to go to Mexico. Oh wait, this is the same shirt I wore the last time I went to Mexico. Oh my gosh. Okay, baby, I love you. Um, I'll see you later. So I am going to Mexico to embark on a spiritual journey of enlightenment. So we are packing for our journey to Mexico. Here's Mama Larry. Cheers, Gretchen. We're doing it. We're on the journey. We're on the road. We're on the road to redemption. I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right, so I'm just going to back in so she can stay there. Okay. Just loading up the car here. Whew. We are packed, honey. Ugh. Goodness gracious. Okay. Got some fresh water. Ugh. All right, so we're going to embark on in ayahuasca. Mama Larry, can you just share just a quick experience? Ayahuasca is an ancient sacred plant medicine <laughs> with a female, a feminine energy, and she heals you. Once you drink ayahuasca, she's in your blood forever and the medicine is always with you. If you don't mind and respect the information that she gives you, you will have challenges in your pathway. So, um, what you need to do is learn how to be present and allow and let go. Unsqueeze your sphincter. All right, so how many shamans are out there? I don't know. I don't know. Never been there yet. Okay, so this is a different one. You, this you, is a different one. How many times have you done ayahuasca? I don't know how many. More years, more than the years I've been alive. Interesting. Interesting. Yeah. Interesting. Well, you've gone to Peru, correct? Several times? Yeah. Well, to I, do it? I just stopped counting after 70. Oh, God. <laughs> Hopefully, I only need once to get to my spiritual path, which I think I'm. Well, might. the first time I did it was for my 50th birthday, and I just had my 60th birthday, so I'm going to do it again. And this is my pennant that I always wear for um, ceremony. And this is the one that I will be always wearing. Cool. Are we ready? Yes, we're ready. Gretchen, we didn't fix each other's thingies. This was what mine. Uh, like. Mine's totally different than yours. What is yours? Uh, it's a different color, but the, the mold is the same.
We have arrived. Hi, Carol. Hi. <laughs> Hi, Gretchen. <laughs> So where exactly are we? We are at a retreat center in Mexico. We are about to do some ayahuasca for some healing um, with a bunch of beautiful souls. Yes, mm -hmm. indeed. So this is where we're gonna be at. We're gonna be all. This is where the awakenings will be happening. Oh, wow. Uh -huh. It's a San Pedro cactus. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, wow. And they make San Pedro tea out of it, which is one of the plant medicines. This one has 14 spines. I'm not even gonna lie, I am a little nervous, but I'm trying to calm myself down and transcend into a higher vibration. I mean, I've done... I've done mushrooms plenty of times, you know what I mean? And so I'm, and other things. So I'm used to like hallucinogenics, I guess. But this is more of a intense feeling, I've been told. And it connects you more to things that you don't want to face and things that maybe you didn't realize that you needed to address. And so, I don't know, I guess I'm a little nervous to face my demons. You know what I mean? This is where I'm sleeping tonight, y'all.
sleeping bag is set up. Ready to go. What's going on over here? A lot of hot air. <laughs> Not enough, um, apparently. It's still blowing. There's a little um, feather. So we're about five hours away from the ceremony. Um, we are no longer allowed to eat. We haven't been able to eat for like the last three hours. Um, there's like so many different rules and like stipulations that you have to follow. Like no sex, like, you know what I mean? No certain foods, only like fruits and veggies. Um, and now I have, this is the last time I can drink water for the next five hours or I guess, I don't know. Until after the ceremony. I'm pretty nervous, I'm not gonna lie. Um, hmm, I don't know. So much is going through my mind, of course, obviously, but I feel good. I feel like I'm meant to be here. Definitely feels like that for sure. There's so many wonderful, awesome people around here. So, yeah. I probably will not film until after the ceremony. I want to respect the space of, you know, everyone and of course the things that I will be going through during that process. But I will definitely be sharing my experience and yeah. So tonight we are sleeping under the stars. Uh, I actually did something different this time around. I Literally. Hand. Just like this. <laughs> a little harder than I thought. I've never slept under the stars before. Although, I did sleep on the beach one time. Yeah. With a bunch of buddies of mine. Like, I woke up on the beach and I was like, whoa. But I don't remember that because I was so damn drunk. <laughs> um, this experience is going to be very interesting. Very, very interesting. Yeah, like, it's, it's like borderline. Yeah, he did a cycle of like this. Wow. That's so symbolic, it's not even funny actually. Are you have got to be kidding me? It's not For this i am ready you're ready to go on the spiritual journey of enlightenment yes ready yes. to heal and you're going to be on my podcast soon yes speaking your story speaking your truth i really appreciate that thank you thank you for the opportunity no of course thank you the honor is all mine Look what came up to Mama Larry. 
Oh, a little, little purring gato. A little purring cat. He wanted to say hi before the ceremony started. Yeah. Oh, you may be. Carol, see my friend. <laughs> I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with animals. It's ridiculous. Oh, hey, baby. <gasps> He just walked up to like he walked up to Larry and then I snatched him from her. <laughs> oh my god, you're cute. Isn't he adorable? Look at that. Oh. They say cats are really good luck, actually. Yeah. That's so cute. <laughs> cats are kind of mean though. And that's with bum. I know. They're at a wedding though. No importing cats or exporting from Mexico. <laughs> well, guess what? <laughs> He's too much. Oh, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, honey. Hi. Oh, meow, meow. <laughs> that's a, that's so Carol. What is everyone saying? Do not trust a fart, right? Do not trust. We it. can't trust an ayahuasca fart because th bad things will happen. It's and a shark. <laughs> <laughs> it will be a shark and not a fart. <laughs> yes. So how far are we? How how far are we? How far away are we from the ceremony? Like in time wise? Um, I want to say like maybe three hours or so. Okay, cool. We're gonna do probably like a warm up um, exercise to get us all loose. Yeah you know release those energies that we don't need and then we'll do the ceremony once it gets dark okay great <laughs> no you ladies ready yes yes, yes. nervous nervous oh you yes you guys got this <laughs> your body let them become a part of your being and allow them to reprogram your mind for success and prosperity I am bold I am brave I am strong I am courageous I am self-reliant I am self-sufficient. I know and understand my purpose. I am intentional. I have purpose and reason for being here. Every day I feel my purpose. Every day I know what I intend for the day. I am disciplined. I am self-assured. secure I 
am confident. I am allowing myself to be me. I am different. I am unique. There is no other like me and that is awesome. I am the best at being me. I am here for a powerful reason. I am great. I am allowing my greatness to shine. I am leaving all excuses behind. I am stepping confidently into my greatness. I am living with happiness. I give myself full permission to be all of me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, I couldn't even begin to explain. There's no explaining. It's just action, that's it. That's all I have to take. It's just action. The journey that I just went through was so transformative and so powerful. And it's okay that people don't understand me. It's okay that I'm different. I am weird and different and awkward and that's my purpose in life. I'm not meant to be understood. And that's okay. <laughs> mm. It feels so good to be me again. I'm so thankful. And I truly, honestly, would recommend this experience to everyone. I mean, unless you have, like, deep mental, like, you know, disorders and issues and stuff like that, I really do recommend for people to go through this journey. Very, very, very transformative. <clears throat> very intense. Very intense. But the shamans were here to help us, so... Yeah. So I'm gonna introduce you guys to Kiara. Hi. She also went through the journey. Do you want to just share a little bit of your experience? Just like you don't have to tell everything, but just um, recap. Okay. The most traumatizing thing I could experience, but it was beautiful. Yeah. Everyone should probably go through this. Right. A lot of self healing, self awareness brought in. A lot of deep, 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 deep healing. That I knew I had, but this was more of like a chance to actually feel and go through it in a different experience. And I'm forever grateful to you meet wonderful people here, like him. Aww, you're so sweet. You're so and sweet. Roger She's very intuitive. She's so intuitive, and she has kind of the same abilities that I do, where it's like you have psychic abilities. You know what I mean? And I'm gonna stop hiding that from the world. You know what I mean? As you should. Yeah. You're the best. Healers. Yes, we are healers. We really are. <laughs> I am resonating at a high frequency. Look at this. I love this room. It's just really cute. Oh, pretty. Literally, our hotel is right there. And this is what we got. This is our view. 
so pretty, so pretty. Yeah. Thanks y'all for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Or else. Just kidding. <laughs>